Hi everyone. Today is 13th January 2024. So I am posting this video after almost uh, two years of my previous post. At that time, uh, we had a leased land in Holi Mangla Electronic City, Bangalore. Um, so it's about two years since uh, I posted that. I'm so sorry for not being able to provide an update after that. A lot of challenges, a lot of things have changed. Um, the soil quality at the least farm, we just could not manage to fix it with, within two years. Um, and we decided to not continue there. Uh, we, uh, we have three cows, as you probably already know. Uh, somebody else is taking care of the cows, but we started looking for a piece of land to purchase on our own. Um, so after terminating the lease, I've been searching for the farm and finally we managed to find one after almost two years uh, and this is the farm so this is in a place called uh, dharmapuri district palakode uh, near palakode it's a it's a village called bevuhalli uh, bevuhalli it's about 100 kilometers from my home that is an electronic city it's about two and a half hours drive but the good thing is there's also a highway coming up uh, very close by at about 10 kilometers from here and it's a proper four lane highway which is a toll road uh, it's nh 844 so i'm just hoping that once the construction of the highway is complete uh, i'll be able to reach here in about two hours from my home so this is 5.21 acres east facing as you see there's a road there um, and surroundings as you see there are a few hills and a lot of farming activity going on here there are some trellises people have done I, I do see some some gods there and here there's a lot of paddy cultivation everywhere as far as water is concerned I do have some doubts um, by the way this is an empty land there's absolutely no assets except for a few large stones here and there uh, there is a bore well but the owner has not been using it he does claim that there's a lot of water in there it's about 1000 feet depth but I don't know, I have not done any testing yet. So I'll keep you posted as we develop this. Um, what we have done so far is, uh, we have done the legal checks. Um, things seems to be clear, which is good. We have done a survey. Uh, the survey took about, almost about half a day. Um, we have measured the whole place. And then we have done these, uh, these poles at the corner points. And at a few few line points like this so we do know the boundary right now uh, and we finished the registration day before yesterday so officially we have purchased the land and what I intend to do is uh, to continue my experiments with natural farming here uh, but before I begin I just want to make sure that we set up the infrastructure right uh, so as an immediate step I'm trying to get the fencing done um, so before we start the fencing we're trying to clean the boundaries that is the JCB um, the bulldozer that is working to clear the rocks at the back and we're just cleaning the you know the section where the boundary is going to come uh, and once this is done this is done then we'll do the fencing and my idea is very simple right now we'll use the stone poles and I'm looking at chain link fencing along with some support for barbed wires so that's the plan as of now and I'll give you an update as we as we progress through um, so as expected as with any land uh, there's a few trouble with some neighbors on the boundary and other things um, obviously we have done a proper digital survey with the presence of village administrative officer um, so we do have all records clear but with that said there are some practical difficulties um, as expected with any land they just got started i'm just hoping that they will all settle soon all right so that's a short update from my side once again sorry for not being able to post for over two years uh, but now i'm big i believe this is a new beginning and i'll keep you posted as we develop things here all right see you soon